All right. So wanted to kind of, you know, obviously Deontay Wilder is a great fighter. You know, he's kind of in the mold of a Mike Tyson. You know, he was really feared, hits really hard. Um, is a part of you um, nervous just because, you know, he, he did suffer those losses? Do you think his aura of invincibility could be, you know, taken away from him? Um, no, not at all. Um, I never thought he was invincible. I don't think anyone's invincible. I have never seen, aside from Rocky Marciano, any heavyweight champion retire undefeated. This is a WBC uh, title eliminator? Correct. Now, uh, supposedly Usyk's going to show up to the fight? That's what I heard, but then I haven't gotten any information he's coming, so I don't know. Would a fight with Tyson Fury, if he's successful, make more sense than a fight with Usyk? No. No, he just came off those. Let him have a fight or two, top quality, top caliber, and then that um, can happen. You, you know both guys extremely well. Who, who do you believe if they're the number one heavyweight in the world? Is right it Tyson, now? Yeah, Tyson Fury yes. or Uzi? So well, the, at this point, I believe Tyson Fury. So does that also mean that you'll take Tyson Fury over Uzi in a hypothetical matchup? No, I want to fight Usyk have those three belts, then fight Fury in a unification. Gotcha, makes sense. And look, the biggest fight probably out there of any fight is who? Deontay and who? Joshua? Of course. Well, I'll push back. I don't know what? if I'll say that's the biggest fight. Why? Let me ask you something. Okay. How much would you draw on his own? Right. So it's the opponent. Yeah, but I, I just meant in terms of the whole boxing. No, no, I that's wouldn't... different. Okay. What I'm, I'm saying as the biggest, in, but look, U.S. and the U.K. are your two biggest markets. Mm -hmm. They're both English speaking. Yeah. The man does not speak English. He beat Joshua, which is great. And he was amazing in the second fight coming back from, the, I think, the eighth or ninth round yeah. when... Yeah. Joshua really had him and then let up on the gas, but Usyk just kept coming. You got to give him all the credit in the world. But I'm not convinced he can beat a Deontay or a Fury, and we'll see. Well, we can can I ask it? one question for y'all? Sure, sure. Um, um, Shelly, how yeah. you doing? Good. I got one question for you. Um, since the Deontay Wilder is a version of like the Mike Tyson or, or Muhammad Ali world figure, had you thought about putting him on a tour? Like fighting, um, since he's African American, I would love for him. He mentioned about Atlanta. And We've about thought Detroit. about we just, thought we thought in Nigeria also. Yeah, yeah. Just the, the thing is, it's opponent driven. If he goes because he's from Alabama to Atlanta, it would have to be someone that we felt credible. We'd love to fight in Atlanta. Okay. Atlanta's just great. Yeah, because the market is good. Just just say Usyk can't fight Deontay right then and there, or just like you said, Deontay is a draw by itself. In a black market like that, where you have successful um, business-minded people, they would love to come out and support. And that is something we're very open. Yeah, Detroit did good numbers when Tyson fought a lot of them. I know. I, so I he was, yeah, I know that. Yeah. So I wanted to see because it's a lot of rumors going around that Deontay's not worthy of being um, all the fame material. That's a bullshit right, article. I know that. Yeah. But but with, with him being a worldwide figure, you know, going around, this would solidify anybody's doubt. Because I agree, but here's to me, and not disrespectful, we have an agenda. I know. Right now, our agenda is winning this fight. Oh, yeah. After, fashion. Right. After that fight, whether it be X and we go to Atlanta, Y, we fight Joshua, maybe in the UK. Yes, um, that's what I want. Okay. Maybe Ruiz as a, um, you know, for the BC to, um, mandatory. Oh, yeah. Or maybe Usyk if he wants to fight us. Exactly. So I have an idea what the crystal ball is, but I can't tell uh, until like after the fight. But what you said, I have discussed more than once and would like that. I want that for so, the so, so, so how, so, he so how would, that. I agree. So how would I agree. A, That should have been one of the top things and coming back. That should be that, you know. 
It was just tired of showing that he's the worldwide figure. I agree. But Chef, but Chef, that, oh, so, that will be. So, so how exactly would a fight between um, AJ and Wilder play out, man? Like, how would it play out? How do you mean play out? Well, do you see do you see Joshua? I mean, do you see Wilder having an early night at the off? Do you think it'll go to the championship rounds? Because I'm assuming you think that Wilder would stop him. Well, the first thing is the fight has to be made. Mm -hmm. um, I have a copy of the email, and I'll show it at the right time to the press. You want to show it now? I, mean, you know, well, I could show it to you, but I don't want to give you the first one. I want to, you know, do it with him. Um, Eddie's... I did not respond to when he sent me an email, and, and I didn't want to. When did he send this email? August. Okay. Because I was fighting, or Deontay is fighting, Elenius, so I didn't want to get into other things. And the letter says, um, I have an idea, let's talk. That's it. The next thing is, I told him I had a wheelbarrow of money, and... Uh, <laughs> We want to fight Joshua. Have you, have you heard that? You're laughing, but did you hear that from so. Eddie? Nah. Oh, yeah, Eddie has said that. Too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Right. You could check it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be and that's why I didn't want to talk to him. Because he'll misconstrue it the way he wants to say it. The time will come after this fight, if he's sincere, that Joshua wants it. We'll make it. Let me ask you both, okay? Sure. So. It's obvious he didn't want to make the Fury fight. Because if he wanted it, he would have made it. Are you saying Eddie didn't want to make it? Eddie or Josh or the team. Would you say the Yes. Yeah. Wow. I don't... I, I wouldn't necessarily agree with that. How? Um, because it, it seems as though... Um, Team Joshua um, agreed to everything, and, but but also Tyson kept on imposing deadlines and then they saying did. not they, a deadline. Look, Deontay, I work for. I'm his manager. Mm -hmm. If he wants something, I have to do it. Mm -hmm. If Joshua wanted the fight with Fury, it would have got done. So are you saying it's Team Joshua Joshua side that that could have gotten it done? So you're putting the blame on them as opposed to Team Fury? Well. I know enough to know that's what it was. And the truth thing is, you don't know it because you're on this side of the camera. Mm -hmm. But on this side, if an, I don't want to fight or my fighter doesn't want to fight, I'll never say, oh, I'm not fighting this guy because then the world comes down on you, right? Yeah. Are you, you listening? Yeah. Mm -hmm. But I can say I want more money. I won't be ready to have the contract ready by the third. Um, I won't be ready by the third. You can come up with a hundred reasons to not make it happen, but not say you're backing out. If he wanted the fight, you turn to your lawyers, I'll pay you overtime, get it done. Make it will happen. It didn't happen. Which fight do you think is more lucrative? Wilder versus um, Anthony Joshua? Joshua versus Tyson Fury. Um, in the UK, maybe um, Tyson and that, uh, because right now Tyson's hot. But people say to me, and I only go by what I hear, the biggest fight of all is Deontay and um, Joshua, because it's been brewing for so many years. Now, was that fight predicated on both of them being successful in their next bout? Well, if Deontay does what he's supposed to do, we're ready. If then... Joshua says, no, I'm fighting December 3rd. I'd have to wait till on um, that fight. If he loses the next fight, he's got problems. So, well, what's your, um, what's your thoughts overall on um, reportedly Tyson Fury could be fighting Derek Chisora? Possibly. What, what's kind of your thoughts on that fight overall? I believe he wins easy. Gotcha. Cool. Thank you. Appreciate it. Man. I want to ask you both something, okay? Sure. You're in the matchmaking business. Okay. I'm sure you fantasize. We all do. Mm -hmm. Who would you fight if you don't fight Deontay with Joshua? If I'm Joshua, who would I yeah. try to set the fight him up? Um, I'd probably say an Otto Wallen. I think that makes a lot of sense. Yeah, maybe. Yeah. Yeah. Am I looking for a winnable fight with the most money? Yeah, why don't I? Okay. 
I don't know how big Wild of the Loon is, although he did a good showing with Fury. Mm -hmm. I don't know the size of him, you know. I mean, Zang. Who? The guy that lost to Felipe Herkovich. The um, Chinese? Chinese? Yeah. That's yeah. Part. You know, I don't think many people think much of him. I think it hurt Philip more than it helped the uh, that guy. Gotcha. Thank you, man. Appreciate you.